All right, good morning, uh, Wednesday the 20th. Uh, yes, only uh, really less than two weeks left in the uh, summer break, summer solstice. Spoo's uh, trading up to 12.75, now we're sitting around 12.70. They um, took them up overnight, then they took them down here, uh, free market 12.68, which happens to be uh, halfway of that uh, point there. 1275, 1262, so uh, smack right in the middle. Probably get a little rally today, I suspect. We're sitting uh, right about the pivot, right below the pivot, just slightly. The pivot is uh, 1272. So again, uh, you get a little run here. Uh, we may be able to break out of that range yesterday. 1274 and a half, uh, 1267 was our opening yesterday. We'll see where the opening 30 minute range is today. No hurry to buy, no hurry to sell on this market. Oil back up, trading 116. Again, uh, we are long some OIH, so that'll be uh, good for us. We pulled off a chunk yesterday as it ran up to this level yesterday um, when it was trading 182s. So uh, again, this market is uh, very thin, very few participants. And uh, we'll see where we end up going at the end of the week, end of the day. But uh, right now we are trading below the pivot. But uh, frankly, I think we got a little oversold. Uh, you've got, uh, again, oil up. You've got uh, gold trading at 821. So again, that has rallied nicely off that eight, that 777 lows. I think oil or gold will bounce back to uh, Probably 850, and you can sell it again. Uh, that is clearly way over uh, sold. 850 to 910, I think, would be a great sell area for the um, market there. So that's about it. Uh, they're getting a little bid on this market, and uh, let's see if we can't uh, rouse up a little uh, rally today. Uh, I got a little upside bent coming in, but uh, that can always change. And let's see uh, how they uh, finish in at the end of the day. But I think, again, I think you can buy down to yesterday's low is 1262. And uh, if you want to, we're at the pivot right now, it's 1271.50. Uh, if we get a test spec down to 1268 and then resume back up, that would be pretty nice uh, start to the day. Uh, not a lot happening as far as stocks, uh, Compaq, uh, HP is trading up uh, about a buck 40. But again, that was off from 46 and a half down to 40 yesterday so it's just kind of filling that gap sold off into that still not a very bullish chart if you look on the daily chart of compact H HP it is uh, not at all bullish uh, matter of fact uh, you're gonna have to get it over 48 really to change that downtrend that we've been in in uh, compact not a lot happening outside of that again in the stock world uh, I see a few names moving nothing uh, Verifone is up Considerably, PAY having a nice uh, snap after the restatement of earnings uh, that they announced. And I don't play that name too often, but that, it's up uh, about 25% PAY. The bell is ringing. Again, we'll wait for the first half hour. Uh, pay has had a nice base here over the last uh, seven, eight months. So that may, with this breakout, be ready to uh, move past 20 maybe over the next few weeks. We shall see on that one. That's about it, and we'll be back later with uh, another recording.